from Cindy Kelly Atomic Heritage Foundation, and it is February 15, 2019, in Hiroshima. And I have with me a very special person. My first question is for her to tell us her name and spell it. My name is Tomoko Watanabe, T O M O K O W A T A B A. I was born in Hiroshima. 1953. Well, tell us about your family and how they have a very special history. Yeah, my uh, parents, uh, my mother and my father was A-bomb survivors. And uh, at the time, 1945, my father was uh, 27 years old. At that time, is a Hiroshima station in the train. He survived. And my mother, at the time, she was uh, 15 years old. Student nurse, Hiroshima Red Cross Hospital. She survived. And after bombing eight years, I was born in Hiroshima. This is our history. Ma started uh, my, uh, as an A-bomb survivor. Uh, my mother uh, was uh, 15 years at the time, and uh, eight years after I was born in Hiroshima. Recently, my mother told me I was so surprised about 50 years after. Finally, my mother told me uh, when my mother has a pregnancy, my mother's body, me it, in her body, she afraid two things. One, I can I can living after the birth because at the time there so many able survivors was died and so after the this baby in my body's baby delivered after I can live or not she afraid another afraid things my baby is a normal or not uh, eight years after, so many baby is awake or some baby has uh, some trouble. And uh, my mother worried about my baby, my first baby is uh, normal or not, but uh, cannot anything. So she couldn't anything. So she only pray for Buddha. And uh, she delivers me. <laughs> I'm a normal baby. So my mother thought my presence, my baby is my hope. I was very moving. After 60 years after my mother told me this uh, uh, her thought in their deep my mother uh, like uh, heart and every time she worried about my health or my uh, growth. I understand now. And so when I was uh, 20, I was grow up in Hiroshima. This other time is uh, Hiroshima is uh, so many A-bomb slum or A-bomb survivors is uh, living together. And the very poor people, most of the A-bomb survivors are very poor and uh, lost to the family and uh, lost to the houses and uh, like uh, mm, very poor slum is uh, uh, living the riverside this is Abram slums my friends are living in here and but I grow up uh, 20 my life is uh, like uh, living together Abram survivor is my normal normal my life. But when I was 20, Hiroshima Shudo Dayak, the university student at the time, my uh, love's grandfather died in front of me. Uh, uh, like her uh, uh, brain blood is a blast and she, he died in front of me. So I was very shocked. Why? Why? Now my grandfather was died. She passed away in front of me and I started the thinking 
still now thinking, what's meaning of the death? What's meaning of the life? And I was suddenly noticed I was born in Hiroshima and my parents were able survivors. And my parents had a what type experience at the time. Uh, so long time able survivors never talk to their own experience. My father never talk. My mother never talk until my uh, uh, 20 years, 20 years old. And I asked other people what happened in Hiroshima. And uh, I think I started to found or I started to learn or I started research about what happened in Hiroshima, especially the under the mushroom cloud. Still now, I listen and found or learn or research what happened under the mushroom cloud. And I notice I have no knowledge. Sure, I have no experience about the atomic bombing, but no knowledge. And I was I graduated university. I decided I started to learn what happened in Hiroshima, 1945, August 6, and uh, what's meaning of the Hiroshima. I really want to know meaning. And still now, I'm learning, I'm listening, I'm thinking what's the meaning of the Hiroshima. And uh, I graduate, and one year after, I married <laughs> with my husband. And 24 uh, years. I have one baby, one, my, uh, I have a child, one son and two daughters. And until 30, I have three kids' mothers. <laughs> and uh, my husband is started uh, the own law office. I'm working as a manager of this uh, law office. Very busy time, but still now keep my mind what meaning of the Hiroshima? What happened in Hiroshima? I really want to know what happened, what meaning. And I was uh, 33 years old. I decided I found it as a small grassroots NGO. Its name is, uh, at the time, is uh, Aji Ano Tomoto Te O Tsunagu Hiroshima Shimin no Kai. So long, long name. This is a friendship uh, association with Asian people. This is the first name. And after I changed Aunt Hiroshima. Aunt meaning the little aunt. <laughs> we are aunts. And other meanings is uh, Asian network of trust. Very important is a trust building people to people. My thought especially the Asian countries. During Second World War, Japanese Imperial Army occupied the China, Korea, Philippines. So many people suffered. So I really want to like a real friendship between Asian people and uh, Japanese people. But Aunt Hiroshima is a grow up. Now is a little bit changed. I really want to uh, trust building all over the world. Asian people's people and American people, or other countries' people, African people, especially the people they are suffered from conflict or disaster or many poverty. I like uh, we, uh, we, especially me, I want to be here. Uh, reach people to people. And uh, <coughs> I started the grass NGOs, uh, grassroots NGOs, but I have no knowledge. 
you know, my English is very poor. <laughs> and I study English. I study what, how to make a project, how to manage project, how to fundraise, <coughs> learning and the learning. This is the implementation. <laughs> it's like a left foot and a red foot, the <laughs> walking, <laughs> learning, learning. A small step by step by step. And a very small are the NGOs. But I think uh, the small is beautiful because uh, uh, usual many big uh, foundation is big money and the project is a very short time. <laughs> but our grassroots energy is very small and uh, no money, no power, <laughs> only big heart, my friend said. And the one project, this big foundation is one year, but Aunt Hiroshima's project is 15 years <laughs> we need. But a uh, long time we are between these people, Pakistan people, or uh, Nepal people, or Philippine people, or American people, we make a strong friendship or trust building. So I working now is 31 years, but uh, I really want to walk uh, until my life, the end of my life. <laughs> this is my mission. And uh, I think Hiroshima Nagasaki has five mission. Five mission. Number one is to convey the reality of atomic bombing. Because all over the world, most people know the only name of the Hiroshima Nagasaki. But uh, most of people doesn't know what happened under the mushroom cloud. This is a very important, not past. This is our near future. So I should, I must convey the reality of the atomic bombing. Hiroshima Nagasaki mission is Aunt Hiroshima's mission, I think. And the second is a nuclear free world. Uh, many people think about nuclear free world. This is a dream, I think, not dream, my reality, our reality. We need the nuclear free world for the children. And uh, number three, peace building activity. Because I was born eight years after atomic bombing Hiroshima. Now Hiroshima is a peaceful city. I'm enough clothes, enough food, enough education. But uh, still now, so all over the world, people suffered the conflict, disaster, or poor poverty, or no water. And uh, this is a similar situation, 1945, after the bombing in Hiroshima. At that time, all over the world, people support us, help us. So I can grow up, I could grow up. No support, no help. Hiroshima citizen, I think, couldn't believe, uh, couldn't uh, live, it, couldn't live. So my uh, mission in the second generation of Avon survivors is I really want to support uh, these people. And so now is uh, so many countries, Afghanistan or Rwanda or Philippines, Mindanao Island or Syria, like this. Palestine like this. But now is Hiroshima. So I really want to Hiroshima people support, help this. And uh, number four is a peace culture and peace education is uh, important for the children for young people. Uh, most of the uh, children think about violence or power is right. So many terrorists, especially suicide bomber, no. Peace 
love or compassion is very important or cooperation is a very important. I really want to teach or talk to the children. And the number five mission is grow up the peace builders, next generation. And this is Aunt Hiroshima's mission. And uh, five mission, under the five mission, I worked a very small project uh, in Hiroshima or out of Hiroshima. Continue to um, every day, I think. <laughs> and mainly, I uh, I have a, a child book project. This is a paper crane journey titles. This uh, child book is uh, two part. One is about the Sadako Sasaki. This is a very sad story. Sadako's story is a very sad story of Hiroshima. Not Sadako. So many children died by effect of the radiation. This is a very sad thing. And uh, this uh, child book is uh, mentioned about the Sadako's friends is started fundraise junior high school student three years fundraise and finally there established this is a child peace monument children peace monument this is our cry this is our prayer for building peace in the world strong wish and uh, this fact is inspires other countries children children ha has a little power but we have a power we can change this is uh, under the philosophy we are small but gathering we can do something for better future and so now with the 31 countries language translated I provide the children that sometimes I uh, go to the countries I talk to children or student or young people and uh, uh, for example uh, five years before the big earthquake hit the Nepal I went to Nepal for uh, like uh, children has a deep trauma so we support to the children used to this book uh, and uh, we are very small but uh, we can do something so I believe I continue to more and more and uh, my uh, dream I have so many young friends or senior friends <laughs> all over the world and uh, we trust them so I continue to cooperate these people to little change for the society and finally dream come true nuclear free world our uh, people's uh, peaceful world and uh, doing 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 walking 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 this is my mission this is my story <laughs>